What is up? I'm Moana Turtle, and today we're going to be talking about Pokemon Masters. And during this, we're actually going to be playing some as well. I haven't been too good about playing this as much as I was earlier. Uh, we're going to be farming up some level up books. I think that's only a 50, which I'm sure is plenty for uh, at release, but you know, just to have some stuff for long term. Uh, but you know, as you can see on this page, I want to go over the news about that they post on sub are uh, on the Pokemon Masters subreddit, how it exceeded five million pre-registrations. I want to take a look at it with you guys to see, you know, is that good? Is that bad? Is that a lot? Is that not a lot? I have no, uh, you know, gauge for for these kind of things. So we're gonna take a look at some information and try to figure out where that, you know, what to take away from this. Uh, the tweet does appear to be in Japanese, but uh, yep, yeah, five. 5 million pre-registrations, is that the same as 5 million installs? Maybe, maybe not, but like, you know, it hasn't even launched yet, so on launch day, whether it be 5 plus or minus uh, some number is likely to be the case. And just look at the comments, uh, I didn't really see anything too interesting in here. Uh, some people see it says, you know, it's pretty insane, um, but uh, let's just take a quick look. It's unclear to me where this came from with iOS and Android combined, I'd imagine that's so. But uh, one thing jumped at me first is expected August 29th. I thought it was a little bit earlier. And they kind of were upfront about saying, you know, this is expected, so could Tia, uh, could change. And it's still expected. And so, you know, who knows? It could be, you know, early September when the game finally does release. And I didn't see anything on the Android store. Uh, any additional information. So that was the first thing that jumped out to me. And so, yeah, 5 million. Is that good or bad um, and I thought kind of like oh well maybe we should compare it to the other Pokemon game that is basically the most popular game in the world right now Pokemon Go and so actually I found this uh, interesting site actually you can't see it but I just uh... Here we go. Um, VideoGameStats.com and then they have a, site, a page about Pokemon Go and I feel like it's just like a long list of pretty useless information uh, but one interesting one I found was number of days it took for Pokemon Go to cross 50 million downloads worldwide and it took 19 days and uh, I'm not sure if you guys remember during that time like that was you know what everyone was talking about when you go outside and you see people looking at their phones like 90% chance they're playing Pokemon Go. Uh, the parks were filled with people just walking around in circles. It was all over the news and everything. And, you know, so 19 days. So what what can we take away from this 5 million uh, for Pokemon Masters? Like, I think this game definitely won't be as popular. It's going to be much less hype. And maybe that's a good thing. And uh, so I'm not sure if you guys remember. Actually, so this is the source of the information uh venturebeat.com sure uh, but yeah 19 days to surpass 50 million and um but uh yeah let's just talk about <laughs> how pokemon go went at release uh in case you guys were not playing it was a terrible experience the game was just so popular but the game really could not handle all the people trying to play it um you know you couldn't log in half the time and then every once in a while you get disconnected sometimes the servers go down all together and i remember you know I, then i joined the pokemon go subreddit and i thought it was like the most toxic community i've ever seen where every single day people were just complaining about uh how bad everything is and we're at the end of the day like simply the the game was not ready to take on as many people as it needed to or rather they would have benefited from much slower rollout and maybe that's kind of like what Pokemon Masters will get with this 5 million although maybe even 5 million is too many um, I think like on, on reddit people are always like oh you know they're already making so much money how can they not fix it and the thing about this uh, with these kind of uh, you know this kind of stuff is it's not fast to fix no matter how much money you have let's say oh I got hired to fix their performance problems I can't fix it on day one or even day 30 maybe even day 60 it takes time to figure out what the situation is and design a elegant solution that will solve it and I think you know then it took months and months and months and eventually they got there um, and you know Pokemon Go like just started off so high that you know, I felt like they got went through insane growing pains because of that in, instant, you know, from zero to 
50 million in like 19 days. Uh, so maybe this Pokemon Masters, this 5 million is a great deal. And uh, so I did try to look at the company, this Dina. Um, never heard of it. And when I went to the app stores, uh, just see like, oh, what else do they have? There's essentially nothing here. I think on iOS is some, I don't know, program, it's some educational app. So, you know, whether or not these, this company is set up to do this kind of uh, mobile game development and, you know, kind of addressing problems and performance issues and releasing new content, who knows? Uh, as far as I can tell from the website, I don't know, press releases, yeah, just the... Uh, milestones in April they succeeded in a peer-to-peer -peer car sharing business yeah nothing about this screams like oh we can we can get this game right off the bat so the slow start sounds really good to me uh, I feel like there's a lot of kinks to work out in this kind of thing especially even if it's not too popular which I think might be better uh, to figure out how they can put out periodic updates whether it's weekly or whatever most most I feel like most much most gotcha games do that and to work through customer service there, this is a gotcha game so there's a lot of money involved too and so there's gonna be a lot of customer service complaints and stuff like that so it would be good to have all that you know kind of like in place before the floodgates really open um, and uh, yeah, so I think this 5 million is a very, I'm guessing it's a very positive sign. Um, you know, is it Pokemon Go? Like, no, but I also don't think we want it to be. I think that would make a terrible experience. And since it doesn't have as much hype as Pokemon Go, like I doubt you see this game in the news, um, you know, it won't, it might not survive a really poor rollout. So um, yeah, I just want to throw that out there, give you my thoughts. And um, yeah, while well, I'm farming up some books, we can take a quick look and see where we're at. Haven't I did try to look at some other Pokemon to try out, uh, but nothing really appealed to me, and nothing too interesting to really test out. So I think I'm doing pretty good on gym books. I think I'm getting close to 50 at this point. Oops, that's the wrong page. So 57 level up manuals. Same thing. That's the thing we need to improve on. Then maybe some more buff blends. That's definitely the most. Uh, used one that appears and then 42 gym books or gym notes. I feel like that's pretty good and We're at a thousand gems um, I haven't heard anything about anything new released, but um, You know when when that does come out we'll definitely do a video on that and uh, Yeah, really excited for this game to come out um, And we'll kind of do a different video about you know what my own thoughts are how you should go about playing this game on launch but uh, yeah, let me know what your thoughts are down below. Does this 5 million sound like a lot? Does it sound like a little to you? Um, do you have any thoughts about relating it to Pokemon Go? You had a terrible experience as I think everyone did when that game first came out. Um, but that's it for today, guys. As always, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe all down below. I'm Juan Turtle, and I'll catch you guys next time.